Another question from Vishal Sharma, and <clears throat> then after that, I'll take some questions which is in this session. Uh, just a minute. Uh, in is it in, is it uh, China's strategy to push Nepal <clears throat> for a constitutional amendment for the map? And uh, will this instigate a rebellion by uh, by the Gurkha soldiers? Uh, that is a sensitive question. But whether Nepal, China is pushing Nepal to do that or not, is not uh, not something that I'm going to second guess. But I am more intrigued by the second part of the question. Say, will will it? Inst instigate or are they trying to his question actually says that are they trying to incite or instigate a rebellion by Gurkha soldiers there I want to step in as an army officer that Gurkhas in Gurkha regiments of Indian army are the best soldiers one of the best soldiers we have in the world they are extremely loyal to the cause and they have been in the Indian army for decades they have crossed a century now the point being made here is whether it is in india or overseas whoever was our enemy the gurkhas have acquitted themselves so well they have integrated themselves in indian army uh, you just don't feel the difference and i doubt that we are ever going to face a problem like that the kind of bonding that we have between officers and men in the gurkha regiments is second to none also, the several linkages that we have with Nepal, that's not my subject, but if we have uh, millions of Nepalese working in India in fields other than defense also, I think there are several uh, layers and linkages. It is not easy. Uh, the two countries are too strongly intertwined. But back to Gurkha regiments, I don't see a problem there. 